I'm just trying to elevate my life and I can't keep doing the same things, you know what I mean? So in order to do better, I gotta move better. I gotta move different. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Sabrina. We are back at it with another vlog. If you are new here, hey girl, hey. And if you're not new here, girl, what it do, what it is, what it ain't, baby. <laughs> but anyway, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe on this video um, and on my channel as well. Follow me on all social media at Sabrina Two Times. I know that's right. <laughs> so today child it is thursday tomorrow's friday and i got a last minute invite with kristen she wanted to go out for her friend's birthday party so girl now i'm getting ready well i'm already ready i'm just having a bit of a hard time trying to pick out what my outfit is going to be so as you can see i am wearing like this rust um silk well satin top with leather leggings and a pair with gold jewelry of course you know this gets taken off when we arrive to the function because we got to keep the edges laid but let me show you the outfit because i want to wear the boots so i can be comfortable and it's cold outside so i won't be wearing a jacket but i know that the correct option would be to wear the other heel so let me show you the heel okay so yeah so look oh excuse me there's the litter i had to clean it but okay so i have these open toed heels which looks great like if you were just like covering half of my body it looks great with the open toe but i want to be comfortable and i really want to wear this boot here the boots are super comfortable and it's cold outside and girl i don't want to and these heels are really old so it's like i know i should be a grown woman and put on these heels but I really want to leave out the house with these boots on. So I'm really stuck in what I want to do because I don't want to put no lotion. Also, my foot is ashy. I don't want to put on lotion and have to put on these heels because they're broken. So I don't know what I need to do, but I know I need to hurry up. I need to button up this sleeve. I literally am ready. I just need to figure out what am I wearing out the door. So let's see. I'm gonna be a grown woman and I'm gonna put on these heels. Although I really don't wanna do it, but I will, so. And I gotta get out of here. And I'm carrying my YSO bag. I'm just giving like, just real quick grown woman, you know? I just know like, that's what the girls would do. Well, that's, honestly, I really don't even care. I'm about to put on my boots. <laughs> As long as I walk in there with confidence, it don't matter what I have on. Okay, period. I already have some of my chest showing, so that's good. <laughs> but, yeah, I'm wearing my boots. I, I want to feel comfortable, and I don't want to feel like I need to have my foot out. So, yeah. next day and your girl is about to go and do some content girl you know we have to do our weekly content in this mug so don't play with it so last time y'all see me 
I'm telling y'all, I'm finna talk to y'all for a little minute before we head out. So last time y'all see me, ooh. Okay, is we good? Okay. So, last time you see me, oh, and I broke a nail. But last time y'all see me, um, I had went to that birthday party. So it was at Rose and Rye. It's over there by Five Church Buckhead. And basically he rented the whole, it's really a rooftop bar, but he rented the whole like inside area out. So we really didn't have to pay for nothing. I got to try a lychee martini girl. If you know me, then you know I've been dying to try a lychee martini for like literally a month. And I was literally obsessed. Ugh. And then, um, just so happens, my freaking waitress was a girly off TikTok. So, we chatted it up. Like, we literally had a good time. It was a little good vibes. The crowd was more of an older, mature crowd. And I'm not saying, like, it's like the upper echelon crowd, corporate world. Like, I'm talking about doctors, lawyers, like, everything in there like and the women in there were so freaking nice like i genuinely had a freaking good time but girl let me tell you i went to the bathroom right so there's two girls they're going back and forth you know in my mind i'm like oh they just drunk da, 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 da. so the girls all like girl you need to block his number you need to block his number, da, da, da. so i come up the bathroom like block his number and she's like no you don't understand like that's all that i know and i and i was like listen this girl right here that's really your friend. Because someone that they don't care about hurting your feelings, they really care about you. And she's being real with you. So block his number. Although that's all you know, it's going to be hard. But you need to get right mentally so the next time he hits you up, he can't have the same access he once had. Like, what? So I'm like, listen, it's going to take some time. It's going to be hard. You probably going to double back. But remember, you need to get over him. If he ain't no good, he ain't no good, sis. He ain't no good, uh, period. He ain't no good. So after that, we ended up hugging it out or whatever. I went back. We had a good time. I actually seen a couple of people that I know, which was really surprising because a lot of people, you know, I know like a lot of people in the fashion industry and now I'm starting to get to a lot of people in the media industry. I'm really trying to break out of the club industry right now. So that's really not my main focus. Honestly, if we be completely real, that's not my main focus anymore. Um, I'm just trying to elevate my life and I can't keep doing the same things. You know what I mean? So in order to do better, I got to move better. I got to move different. So that's what I'm trying to do. Anyway, after that, everyone decided to go to Whiskey Mistress, girl. Although I wanted a nice, good hookah. So I went to Whiskey Mistress and the parking guy was all like, okay, so we got self parking back there, $20. You got to hurry up and get it before this truck get it, or you're going to have to pay 80 What What? What do you mean I got to hurry up and get it before the truck get it? Do you have a spot or no? So I'm like, you know what? I'm not even going to argue with him. So I end up pulling up. You know what I mean? I guess the truck see me trying to go get the spot, child. He <laughs> knocked a bitch off the road, okay? Knocked a bitch off the road and took that spot. <laughs> I'm like, okay, so he took the spot. Like, what can I do? He's like, well, parking up here $80. I'm like, I'm not paying $80 for me to park my car myself. You're not even going to be here by the time I leave here. So I'm, I call, I call Kristen. I'm like, Kristen, girl, I'm just going to go. Like, I swear, although I wanted a good hookah and I wanted to continue on with the vibes, but at the end of the night, I got to come back to a car. I gotta come back to a home. I don't need no. I don't need my window broken into. I'm not gonna park on no sketchy street. Like no, I don't mind paying for valet, but there was. I'm not paying eighty dollars. Mm mm. Get somebody else to do it. I'm not. It ain't worth it. And I was gonna be there literally for like thirty to forty five minutes. Literally, cause they closed at like what we left the birthday party at twelve. I think whiskey closed at two or three that night, but I only planned on staying to like. 1 30 honestly because i had to get up in the morning and do this <laughs> okay so um yeah i'm just like i'm not about to do it so yeah i ended up going home all right it was a great night um they actually invited us to a friendsgiving next week so i'm definitely going before i go and spend time with my friends gotta get drunk okay so yeah so what i'm about to do now um 
I'm just going to take some content photos. Yeah, I had a photo shoot yesterday too. <laughs> Don't play with me. Yeah. So, honestly, this is actually a really busy week. I'm, you're actually going to see me in my makeup a couple times this week because I have a, um, a promo video to film for Black Friday for a brand. I'm doing some content. I had the photo shoot. I didn't vlog the photo shoot because it just happened real quick, fast, and I like to be in my zone. But, yeah. So, yeah, we about to do this content, girl. And then I really want a matcha, but I'm going to just wait till tomorrow because I get my nails done tomorrow and I get a wax tomorrow. So, I can just get a matcha in. So, yeah. Um, today's fit. Today's fit is by Amazon Chill. Literally, my whole outfit is literally from Amazon. Like, people don't even know. People think this is like Chrome Hearts. Girl, it's Amazon, okay? I actually got my pants tailored because they were, like, really big. Um, So, yeah. So, I'm going to take a picture in this fit, and then y'all going to see. And I'm going to pair with my boots from Ego Official. They're like the shark boots, the Givenchy shark boots. So, And I'm going to put, like, my leather jacket. And I'm trying to see if I should do like a black bag or I have this silver bag. I think I'm gonna do the silver bag, but yeah, I'm gonna post the pictures so y'all can see. And y'all might as well just follow me on IG since we talking about it anyway, cause it's gonna be on here, period. So yeah, let's hurry up and go before the sun go down and before it gets too cold, cause I am hungry. I literally haven't ate all day and it's 320. <laughs> it's literally 320, so. Let's go ahead and pack it up so we can get the content and slay for the girls, the girls, the girls, the g -g 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 girls. <laughs> hey guys, today is Friday and to be exact, it is Black Friday. <laughs> Girl, Thanksgiving, I literally had a freaking blast with my family. And then I even went out last night just because literally we had everything except I wanted to smoke some hookah. So I was like, hey, I'm like, girl, you want to smoke some hookah? And the next, you know, we was outside having a time, okay? And we had a time last night, period. But yesterday we were at dinner and I was telling, well, not at dinner, we were eating dinner. And I was telling my dad how, you know, I'm about to take a couple of trips coming up with the next couple of months and how I need to get me a new travel bag. And he's all like, oh, well, I can get you a travel bag for your Christmas present. So, girl, we are going to go look for my bag today on Black Friday. Now, I know <clears throat> that it's like a huge mistake to do so on Black Friday. I guess he want to use this time as like our daddy-daughter time, which is so cute. I love that for me and us. <laughs> So yeah, we're gonna go to Mall of Georgia today. I've never been to Mall of Georgia, but it is Black Friday. So I have on a my one piece BB jumpsuit because I need to be comfortable. You never know, we're gonna have long lines or whatever the case may be. I have my Prada bag, the crossbody, because we don't need to be carrying on our shoulder. We don't need to be like this, all easy access. And I, of course I have on a jacket. We're not gonna be there that long. Although it's an hour drive, so I am going to stop and get Starbucks first. But, um, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> so, yeah, um, I don't know exactly what bag that I'm looking for. I'm not going for an exact name brand, honestly. Like, honestly, if you being a hundred, I would like a Chanel travel bag. But <laughs> I'm going to probably get that with my own money. It don't matter. Um, so, um, it don't even matter what kind of brand. I just need a nice bag preferably with a hard exterior with a zip up because right now what i'm using for my travel bag is my louis neverfull we all know neverfulls they don't zip up and i don't want to be having my stuff people will be able to look at my bag so i used to work for michael kors i used to have like this jet set bag so i'm really going for that if i can get that in like a, a soft pink i know that's my color or a black that go with anything i think i'll be good with that but Right now, I'm just being very optimistic about everything. So, we're going to see um, what I can get. And should we can start to Sephora, that'd be good, good too. Because y'all know I'm on my high-end luxury beauty um, type of thing. And I want to try the new, well, not the new, but I want to try the Chanel Contour Palette and their setting powder. So, I don't know. But... Yeah, if not, I'm not really going into this with any expectations. <laughs> I'm not going into this with any expectations. I'm 
any expectations. So let's just see how it works out. Let's go and get this um matcha because I really need one. I really don't need one, but I need one. And I'm hungry. I'm not going to get a snack. I feel like I should, but I'm not. I am going to get a matcha. Matchas make me hungry. I don't know. We're going to see what I should do because I haven't ate yet. So we're going to see. And then, um, yeah, just go from there. So let's go ahead and head out. And we're going to vlog. And then I will check in with y'all when I come back home. Um, 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 um. Oh, I have this little bump on my chest. It's giving like chest knee. I don't like that. It literally came out of nowhere last night. I'm like, oh my God, luckily I didn't have my chest out. But when I was getting dressed, I'm like, what is this? That I felt something hurting on my chest, but... Ew, this is not cute. December 1st so girl we have some errands and my errands I mean shopping to do um so I have been going back and forth for the past week on if I should get a Christmas tree and I have made my decision drum roll please I am getting a Christmas tree yeah. let's go so, um, yeah, I'm getting a Christmas tree, girl. I have to make a return first. And then um, I have this, see, I bought this cute leather top from, I don't know how to pronounce this name, but I purchased from them before. Girl, it's so cute. It's just so small. It's so small. So I just need a bigger size. I'm going to change it for a bigger size. So we are going, today we are going to Zara. I want to get like a crop puffer jacket for my camo pants for like this cute edgy type of time girl look like she's a rough rider and then um I may stop at Bath and Body Works to get some candles um just because it's their Christmas sale so a lot of book night and then um yeah I'm ordering my Christmas tree off Amazon and I'm going to go to Home Goods because, let me show y'all my nightstand after I wrap this up. I mean, not my nightstand, my um, TV stand. My TV stand is almost complete, but I feel like it's missing something. Like, I need something in the middle, so let me show y'all. Okay, so this is my TV stand. I'm going to add a black Chanel, bo uh, Chanel book above the Versace book and then keep the pink candles. The pink candles are going to stay. I bought a Chanel candle to put right there, but I need something in the middle right there. And I'm thinking if I should like buy a clock or just have something gold there. So like, even if I do decide to get a different color candle, it can still be there. Or I'm thinking about um, just giving like a cute, like a sign that says faith or something. I don't know, but the Christmas tree is gonna go right there. So that's how we're going to home goods is to find something to put in the middle right there. Cause that is coming. I think that's coming when the Christmas tree get here. So I'm going to film when the Christmas tree get here in a couple of days. Y'all know it's on prime, period. But, um, yeah. So, yeah, that is the plan to find something to put in the middle. If I can't find something from Home Goods, 
then that's fine. It's gonna be a little disappointing. I just it's gonna take me a little bit longer to complete the TV stand, but um I can easily order my Christmas tree off Amazon. I gotta ship this off and then if hopefully I can find a crop olive green or maybe I don't want to do another crop black jacket, but I want it to be crop and I want a puffer jacket. So Ooh, excuse me. So hopefully I can find that. If I can't find that, then I'm not getting nothing out of Zara. I may probably just get some candles and then come on home. And then that'll just be my day. Because I really don't have plans. Because like I said, everything for my Christmas tree, I'm ordering offline. So I really don't have to leave the house. But since I am, I need to make this off. So, oh, ghetto. So, um, yeah, let's head out. I'm starving, so I'm going to cook myself to eat when I come back home. Um, yeah, but we are going to get some Starbucks, so I'm going to try this new drink, period. <laughs> oh, and an outfit today, I'm just wearing Fashion Nova jumpsuit, gray, blue jean jacket, and a pink hat. It's not that cold out today, so this is definitely appropriate. And I think I'm going to put on my phone runners. Yeah, so let's go. Second every minute, man, I swear that she can get it Say if you a bad bitch, put your hands up high Hands up high, hands up high Tell them turn the lights down right now Put me in the mood I'm talking about dark moon perfume Go, go I recognize your fragrance, hold up, you ain't never gotta say shit, mm. And I know you taste this a little bit, mm, high maintenance, mm. Everybody else basic, you live life on an everyday basis With poetic justice, poetic justice If I told you that a flower bloomed in a dark room, would you trust it? I mean, I write poems in these songs, dedicated to you when You're in the mood for empathy, it's blood in my pen Better yet, with your friends and them I really wanna know you all. I really wanna show you off. Fuck God, pour up plenty of champagne. Cold nights when you curse this name. You called up your girlfriends and y'all curled in that little bitty range. I heard that she wanna go and party. She wanna go and party. Nigga, don't approach her with that Atari. Nigga, that ain't good game, homie. Sorry. They say conversation. A nation, I can tell, but I could never write my wrongs unless I write it down for real. P.S. You can get it, you can get it, you can get it, you can get it. And I know just know just know just know just know just what you want. Oh, what it just is, put it in the song. All right. You can get it, you can get it, you can get it, you can get it. And I know. Just know, just know, just know, just know, just what you want. Oh, what it just is, put it in the song. All right. I really hope you play this, cause oh girl, you test my patience With all these seductive photographs and all these one-off vacations You've been taking, clearly a lot for me to take in It don't make sense, young East African girl You're too busy fucking with your other man I was trying to put you on game, put you on a plane Take you and your mama to the motherland I could do it, maybe one day When you figure out you're gonna need someone When you figure out it's all right here in the city And you don't run from where we come from That sound like poetic justice Poetic justice. You were so new to this life, but goddamn, you got adjusted. I mean, I write poems in these songs dedicated to the fun sex. Your natural hair and your soft skin and your big ass and that sundress. Ooh, good God, what you doing that walk for? When I see that thing move, I just wish we would fight less and we would talk more. They say communication, save relations, I can tell, but I can never write my wrongs unless I write them down for real. P.S. You can get it, you can get it, you can get it, you can get it. And I know just know just know just know just know just what you want. Oh, what it just is, put it in the song. All right. You can get it, you can get it, you can get it, you can get it. And y'all explain to me why I put the dang tree on wrong. This is the top of the tree. And is it kind of crooked? Oh my God, it's kind of crooked. Anyway, that's the top of the tree. And then these are the bottom parts. So I need to restart it. 
all over. Oh my God. I feel so slow right now. But at least I know that I need the, well, it's crooked now because I just unscrewed it. But girl, I didn't mess up. Hold on. Every time I write these words, they become a taboo. Making sure my punctuation curve, heavy letter hits true. Living my life in the margin, and that metaphor was proof. I'm talking poetic justice, poetic justice. If I Okay, y'all, uh, so after struggling, here is my Christmas tree. She's so cute, so simple. Of course, we got the white, the pink, and the gold to match my overall aesthetic of my apartment. And I am in love. Yes, the tree is pre-lit, so boom. I got these candles lit, so yes. I want to say thank you guys for watching, and I will see y'all in the next vlog. Bye, guys, and happy holidays. <laughs> Told you that a flower bloomed in a dark room. Would you trust it? I mean, you need to hear this. Love is not just a verb. It's you looking in the mirror. Love is not just a verb. It's you looking for it, maybe. Call me crazy. We can both be insane. A fatal attraction is coming. And what we have coming is pain.